The next thing I wanna do is add product categories to make sure to keep everything organized and sort my products into categories or collections. So to do that, let's go to products and click on collections. Now by default, we have this homepage collection, which actually I don't need. So I'm gonna select it here, go to the three dots and click on delete collection and confirm. And now to create our first product category, let's click on create collection. And the first one for me is gonna be backpacks. So I'm gonna type that in here. And we can also add a short description for this category. And under collection type, I'm gonna keep this at manual for now because I wanna manually add my products to this category. And then we also wanna add a category image right here. So I can just drag and drop this image to this field and then click save. And now when we go back to our collections, we can see our first product category. To add more categories, we just click on create collection again and then go through the same process. So now I've added a few more collections to this store, but currently all of my collections are empty. As we can see here, it shows zero products for all of the collections. So the next step is to add our products to the respective collection. So to do that, let's go to our products. And then here we wanna select all of the products that go into a specific collection or category. So I'm gonna start with the backpacks. So I'm just gonna scroll down and look for all of my backpacks. So here is one, here is another one. And then here we have three more. So now all of my backpacks are selected. So what I can do now is go to the three dots up here, click on add to collections, and then I'm gonna choose the backpacks collection and click save. And then we wanna do the same thing for all of our categories. So now I've added all of my products to the correct category. So when we go back to collections, we can now see that there are products in each of the categories. 